A few of you guys will have questions. Why is the red uh, light blinking when you're charging the additional packs? And that's because the BMS is trying to balance uh, all the cells because this is only 2.5 amps and these packs are 6.57 amps. So it takes longer to charge these two packs. And because this one is, uh, let's say, getting up to 40.5 volts faster, the BMS is blinking the red light just to notify that actually it's trying to balance uh, the additional packs so it evens the voltage. And once the voltage is close to, let's say, this is 40 volts and this is 40.5 or 4, it will stop blinking. So the red blinking light uh, might scare you, but actually doesn't do anything to the board, so you shouldn't be worried about that. And um, uh, as I mentioned earlier, the BMS that's here on the board controls all the packs so even if you forget to to unplug it it will show green but actually it will stop at 40.5 volts and it's not going to push any more voltage into the uh, into additional cells so it's it's good not to forget that and leave it overnight uh, which actually says in the manual you should not leave the board unattended while charging but they just to let you know i test a couple times and uh, the red light kicks in after 40 minutes i checked with the voltmeter after then after one hour two hours and three hours and uh, the voltage stopped at 40.5 so that's definitely safe and the bms definitely helps so uh, other people have actually asked me in the comment the comments below saying why didn't you put a bms uh, by putting a bms on each pack will actually create a conflict between them and will confuse them so might not might not even work properly so having only one bms and controlling all of them because it's the same, uh, it's all in parallel, actually works perfect. So if you guys have any other questions, comment below and I'll see you next video.